I hope this looks like Mitski. It's mirrored. So that also, I think it looks like, I'm gonna paint this for, this is the work in progress. I was gonna record the sketching, but I was so tired, busy. I wonder if it sounds like ASMR. I didn't say that. I have my tea. Good warm tea, hot tea still. I'm gonna try to record the process, yes. Mm. And we'll see how it goes, cause sketchbook tour no this is not a sketchbook tour here i'll give you i'll give you my favorite page i'll give you my do i have a favorite page wait hold on i'm sure there's a page that i really like i'll give you the i'll give you somebody's favorite page i don't know why i'm so shy it's my girlfriend's favorite page it's not that deep i don't know uh, oh it looks like that one looks really wonky in the viewfinder i like all of them i guess in a way but this is my attempt at drawing Mitsuki. This. And th it's better when it's not reversed. So that means that this one must be pretty good then. If this one doesn't look as bad as these ones do. These ones look bad in general. So that's fair enough. Shame this does not look like Mitsuki. But I told myself. I told myself that I'm much better at painting people than I am at just like that. Because it is realism. So it makes sense, doesn't it? That a person would be better at that than other things. Because like. I drew Cape Town, and it didn't look much like Cape Town. But, you know, when I added watercolor and color pencil, it turned out fine. So it'll be okay. Oh, my God. Oh, it'll be okay. <laughs> it'll be all right. Okay, so we're beginning the voiceover now for this hello. So the whole reason I'm making this painting in the first place is it's a, it's a gift. Okay, the day has passed. It was initially for my partner's birthday. But, unfortunately, I take forever, and also, I get caught up a lot, and I end up uh, hanging out with them a little too often, which is fine. It's great. I enjoy myself. They say they enjoy themselves, so like, hoping for the best there. But, unfortunately, that means less time for painting. And also, I have class. Oh, here's where I started my detrimental mistake. Hello again. I have um, white paint, which is evidence that I've been painting. I suppose um not much not much not not something that I should be particularly braggy about considering this is where it's at I recorded a time lapse of myself painting this but first okay there's okay it's not that bad it's not that bad it was like not showing up at all on camera I'm sure if I upload the time lapse if I don't delete it because it's pretty much useless because you could just pink you couldn't just see this freaking pink it's still drying i probably shouldn't pick it up but i could as long as i can see it, it's fine but we'll see how that goes because i was talking to myself in the camera and i was trying to show it and explain the mistake that i added a bit of purple to my paint because i thought it would make it more pretty and pink you know but and it did it did it did but it's a nice color, but but I, I can't really see what's underneath it is a thing that is um, off-putting. So, we're going to, um, this is all I'm doing for tonight because it's late when I have been, I spent like an hour trying to set up. I think it'll be fine. Trust the process, trust the process. Hello? Who are you? Um. Have you been FBI agent in my phone? Uh, unfortunately, no. Okay, so at this point, I went off camera and I just painted the background blue so I could just get the figure, you know, going. Uh, and then I started painting the skin, which was fine, but the colors on this painting were a lot to deal with. But I, that's why I did it, because I, I like the abstract colors. I like making things more difficult for myself. But human skin's going to be hard anyways, so here it is. I think it, it's going well at this point, because I didn't know what was to come, but ultimately it did turn out pretty nice so i can't really say too much um that's that's all there really is to it hi oh i have orchata today not tea this is a mitsuki painting thus far it's coming along okay i should i didn't paint this like who days in a there should be more here but there isn't we're gonna fix that today we're gonna speed run this sh stuff because I need it done in like two days. So, 
Oh, wish me luck. You know what? You know what, though? You know what I encountered when I was painting it, though? My cat, like, stepped, like, right over it. And I don't know if you can see it in the time lapse very well. But, hello, miss? She's all right. Um, And I also, I have a bad tendency to put brushes, like, carry them in my mouth. And so this time there was paint on like both sides of the brush. So I got it like on my mouth, you know, at least I have this going for me. Um, more progress today. I should hope. You know what else? You know what else? It's really hard to see the sketch. No kidding. Who could have, who would have guessed? Who would have guessed that it'd be so difficult to see? I think that's the hand. That's a finger. That's another finger. There's the rest of the, it's not that bad, but it's bad. Thank God for reference pictures. And I haven't even tackled the face yet. The skin is so off, but like, I guess just build up. I'm going to try to get a bunch of it done today and then hope for the best. Oh yeah, I want to show you my partner's dog. This is tiny. Um, I'm exposing her for clout because she's a cute dog. Just like how I expose my cat. <gasps> you should see my cat. She ran away. She doesn't want clout. Okay. Okay, well, clearly she did end up wanting clout because she's over here watching me paint. But also, she could just be admiring my work. And honestly, I appreciated the moral support, even if it was just for a couple minutes. And then she left me. But that's all right. Um, here, it seems like I'm working on the dress. Okay, in the end, the dress did not come out as nicely as I would have hoped for. Considering how much time I allotted towards it. But, oh well, that, that's on me. But the important part to me was the face. And... In the end, I liked how it came out, but here's me working on blocking in more of the colors and everything. Yeah, pretty much. Hello. It's been a while. As in, I haven't worked on this in a while. It's been a few days. Um, that was my bad. The last time lapse that I recorded, it was a, a little bit less. I, I kind of had to look to save it. Now that I'm seeing it in the mirror view, her head feels a little bit too much this way, so that's pleasant um, i think i saved the proportion so i can tell where everything goes i kind of sketched the face a little bit i'm gonna have to rely on that a little bit more but i think that i have everything like because i completely lost my sketch when i decided to to cover it with pink paint you know as one does back to painting okay so i should clarify this ended up being for valentine's day we had a good one but also my partner goes by they them pronouns that's important to me everybody should know that um and that's why i'm switching between boyfriend and girlfriend because that's what they prefer uh it's a pretty random note but just important for everybody to know so they're not doing anything wrong in the comments or anything uh i'll just let the rest of this time lapse play out and then you'll see the rest of my amazing painting abilities okay idea to join back in in real time because I've been talking a lot about this freaking painting it's finally saved a little bit because I colored the face does that exactly look like her no am I making up a lot of colors yes but that's why I chose this painting so that way I could but put a lot of random colors on it I feel like I made her forehead too big but like I have to give her eyebrows and also, I need to put more hair over here, I could tell. And, like, you know, solidify the blue outline that's around it. Because it's kind of, like, hesitant. Because I could barely see my trace. Um, and I gotta give her eyebrows. But after I put the whites of the eyes in, it looked a little... Oh my god. Sorry, I scratched that and my cat beats me. Um, so, I think I'm gonna leave it talking for a second. While I work. Because... Oh my god. Man, all my paintbrushes. I use the back of the paintbrushes as, like, the... What is it called? As make like palette knives. Cause I don't have any. But you know, so um my partner really likes pink. This is magenta, but it looks pink on the bot. It looks pink. So I thought magenta was more purpley. I guess not. But I'm gonna use this because it needs some red, so I'm gonna mix it with some red. And then we're gonna put that in some of the crucial areas. 
I should be doing the the eyebrows to like make sure I could work around it, but brain says pink will make it go burr, so we're gonna do that really quick. Actually, no, because I want to just record this really quick, just me doing the eyebrows, so we could see if it saves or not. And if it doesn't, then I'm gonna use a nice black because I have that trashy black that I want like dead, and I have a bad habit of using bad paint just to get rid of it and not waste it. But I, if I want the eyebrows to actually look, you know, black, then I need to use a nice paint. We're gonna just do the eyebrows and then I'll probably go back to time lapse. Maybe the eyes too, because her eyes are kind of just black in this. No, don't do it, Mr. Lipinski. <laughs> um, I think the little brush should do, but it kind of sucks, I think, at, you know, getting paint and everything, so that sucks. But, you know, we need the detail and such. I think I'm gonna mix it with maybe purple to make it less dark because it's it's it may be black, but like I don't know. Something about it just oh wait, I scraped that way too hard. I probably got old paint on it. Dang, okay, well I can't reuse it. This is purple as far as I know. Also, I forgot to make note of the fact that I have paint on my freaking face. If you saw it, I don't know. I think it's on wait. If it's on this side or this side, but oh those white will be <clears throat> my process frustrates me at times. But it's okay. That's why you clean them off and you actually, you know, don't mix colors like that. But that's just my process. I just love like mixing colors together. Cause I'm not very much of a perfectionist. But I guess for this one I probably should have tried to become a little bit more of a perfectionist, huh? I'm gonna single hair and it's gonna wreck my career if not my career, but my oh god, it's right there. If it happens to like leave a smear somewhere I don't want it, I'm gonna cry. So Hello, editing me here. Uh that's exactly what happened. Yes, I did in fact cry a little bit. Not actually, but you'll see how exciting that was. I wonder if you can see my big head. All right, and I think that's a sign to take myself out of my own misery and stop talking, you know, verbally, in 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 person, in real time, because I'm very awkward about how I talk and everything, so this is honestly for the better, but I decided that it'd be a good idea to yap a little bit, I believe, for a few minutes. I'll, there'll probably be some quiet. I'm sure I'll put music or something over this, but I wanted to brag about the fact that I'm going to a Mitski concert with my girlfriend. <laughs> um great yeah that was pretty much it i don't know how i went through the entirety of the video without having mentioned that i'm going to said mitski concert it, it's in march like at the end of march ish and i really look forward to it and that kind of inspired because my partner really really loves mitski um as they should i i love mitski too uh any any excuse to have mommy issues no i'm sorry i apologize no i don't um it's not it's not that deep it's just motherless behavior you know it's all right i'm all right but at least i love mitski you know those songs i can appreciate them fully you know it just speaks to those with mommy issues and it's great i'm very happy about it you can see my freaking big head in the corner this whole time i think i'm gonna draw something to like yap in the corner because i think that'd be cute um here you can see I'm filling in the eyes and the eyebrows. I don't know how I thought I was doing so good <laughs> at this point. Because once I finished it, the face turned out a lot better. The body doesn't get much better. I think that's like it. I don't remember if I filmed the rest of the body. I think I'm done with it at that point. Yeah, I didn't go back in for that. I wanted to like focus on the face more so than any other part of it. And I, I achieved what I wanted. It looks nice like in abstract. It's not too... I wasn't going for perfectionism. If I was, I would not have waited that long to begin, but I had my fun. I had my like blotchy colors everywhere. That's just how I enjoy painting. I don't really like full realism. I'm good at like drawing full realism and everything, but it's not exciting for me. So I wouldn't really want to do that. Maybe one day I could try really hard to do it, but I don't look forward to that. Um, my hair looks dry. Goodness, my, my little cousin she always yaps at me about how dry my curls are and I, I guess I can see it now just the self-awareness that looking at the back of your head brings you 
Goodness gracious. But anyways. Yeah, I'm trying to fix the faces. Oh, you can see. That's the point where I messed up. And you can see the little black dot right there. Goodness, I have made some mistakes. It's because I use the back of my brush like a palette knife and that is not so smart to do if you're going to be as rough with it as I am I've gotten paint all over my face and my hair all probably because of that method but I'd rather die than buy a palette knife okay I'm just surprised I haven't like accumulated one in all my years okay I'm gonna stop so there's this oh my god how did that get there how did that my process it failed me again Okay, so there's no check-in at this point, but this is like right at the end where I finished up painting. I tried to save it as much as I could. I finished up the face. You'll see my cat. <laughs> she just blocked her face. She's so cute. I love my cat, even though she doesn't always love me, but I love her all the time. Um, I'm finishing up the face. I did end up being pretty proud of it. I did not take a picture of it at the end. I will be getting a picture from my partner, obviously. Um, but yeah, it was a pretty nice. It was fun. I'll talk about it more over a picture i suppose all right this first one is literally just me after making the first progress picture of where it just turned out pink um pretty self-explanatory this second one is of me with said paint on my face i remember it being bigger there was also some under my lip but like i don't think you could see it very well and my beautiful cat mams who i will still use for clout no just kidding this is another progress picture but i kind of my knee got in the way i didn't think too hard about it but oh well and this is what it ended up looking like when i was done except i added words to it you'll see right now um uh, but that's what it looked like in my lighting so it was pretty warm but when i ended up giving it to my partner they um it was kind of cooler <laughs> in color but you'll see and this is what it looked like at their house i added some lyrics of i believe one of their favorite songs it should be one of their favorite songs but um I thought that it was pretty fitting and something that they should have on their wall so I put the lyrics and this is the angle we usually see it from also to mention the artwork that you see around it one of them is uh, two of them are prints and then the rest that look like pretty consistent art style they're um, my partner's art so they they draw they 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 paint well those are paintings and they're, they're quite nice they're very nice so you, you should you should go check them out you, and this is a close-up that they so graciously took of her forehead so that's lovely um i'll put their account in the bio i suppose um thank you for watching this progress video it's been fun it's been real um 